So we are looking at a tree and we are standing 45 feet away from the tree and we're looking at the top of the tree at a 30 degree angle. We can use trig to find the height of the tree because we have a right triangle there. So the height would be the opposite side and the 45 would be an adjacent side. So that means we should be using tangent. So tangent of, let's see, what was the angle? The angle is 30 degrees equals the opposite over the adjacent. And the opposite is the height, which is our x. And the adjacent is 45. So tangent 30 is just a number that you can get in the calculator. And we want to get x by itself, so those are things we're thinking about. Uh, what's on the same side as x? There's a 45 on the same side as x. It's divided, so we want to multiply both sides by 45. We did that to cancel that. So now we need to do 45 times tangent of 30. So 45. Oops. 45 times tangent, 45 times tangent of 30 equals, sometimes you got to figure out the calculator, right? Sometimes it wants the number first, sometimes it wants tangent first, and we get an answer of 25.98 x equals 25.98. Ta-da! And that makes sense. The 30 degree angle is going to be, since it's the smallest angle in the triangle, it's going to be across from the smallest side. And since the bottom is 45, this side should be less than 45, and it is. It's, you know, like 26. So. There we go, using trig to find the height of a tree.